Hi everyone, I'm local correspondent Raymond Braun with amazing Jason Collins, retired NBA athlete who was a star at the convention. He gave an incredible speech here on the convention floor. Thank you so much for taking the time to chat with us, Jason. Of course. Could you share a little bit more about the decision to come out to the Clintons before you came out to the world and how those conversations helped you throughout the process? I came out privately to the Clintons uh, before I came out publicly on the pages of uh, Sports Illustrated. And uh, I spoke a little bit about the words of advice and their support, unconditional support that I got from the Clinton family. Jason and I uh, roomed together for about six months uh, during my sophomore year at Stanford. He, at that point, was literally the biggest guy on campus, but also <laughs> was uh, they were the number one basketball team in the country. He was one of the best players on that basketball team. He called me one day um, before the story aired on uh, Sports Illustrated and let me know that he was about to come out. Um, I was surprised, but um, I was not surprised that it was him. Meaning that for as long as I have known, Jason has been a person of integrity, a person of strength, um, somebody that is never looking to own the spotlight, but who's never going to back away from doing what is right for his friends, his family, and his, for his community. I didn't want uh, certain people from my private life to read about me coming out. on the. I, I wanted them to hear it from me first. And um, with the Clintons, they offer nothing but words of uh, advice, and uh, I will share something that uh, Chelsea uh, said to me, which is um, just continue to live your life. Uh, with Hillary, with her mom, as our president, uh, she will care about all of us, not just some of us. And I really feel that the other side, they really only care about uh, a, a certain percentage of our country and not all of us. I always speak from you know, my experiences, but at the same time try to put myself in the shoes of other people, transgender issues, and then also issues uh, for people of color in the LGBT community. This is part of our ongoing coverage with LogoTV.com and across all of Logo's social channels to let you know what's going on this election cycle and why it is so important for our LGBT community to stand up and have our voices be heard. Thanks again, Jason. Thank you.